my advice to scouts would definitely be stay professional and headstrong. Um, definitely keep focused on what you want to do and strive to meet your goals. Um, it's a great company and if you meet all the things that you set for yourself and the goals that you meet for yourself, you'll definitely move up in the company. The message I'd like to deliver to the scouts most is that although when you're out there in the field doing what it is you do and doing it well, you might feel as if people elsewhere in the organization don't appreciate what you do. But let me tell you this, they do. They appreciate you from the top all the way down. I appreciate you. My management team appreciates you. The directors of the company appreciate you. And more importantly, the talent appreciate you. So please continue to do what you do best. Continue to do it knowing how much you really are appreciated. For everyone out there who has just started working for the company or who has been with the company for a long time, um, it is groundbreaking, it is revolutionizing the industry, and uh, there is tremendous amount of uh, growth. Um, I moved up through the ranks very quickly, just um, I worked as hard as I could, tried to do the best thing, and when I made a mistake, I tried to learn from it and go on. I didn't get upset and quit and, oh, oh my gosh, I'm never going to get it. I just stick it with it. I know. Um, you might deal with a lot of controversial um, issues. I mean, it is different, it is new, but um, you know, so is everything else that has uh, been very profitable and uh, made a difference in the world. If they're continuously heading out to the same mall at the same time doing the same thing, they're not going to be successful. Um, they need to step outside the box and um, spend time in different areas, different events, festivals, um, and at the same time, continue scouting even when they're doing their daily activities, like going to the grocery store, picking up the dry cleaning. There's no telling there's not an adorable kid sitting in a grocery cart with their mother. Uh, Advice I would give to scouts starting out, um, you really have to be self-disciplined. You really have to be motivated. Um, just remember what you're doing is a great thing. You're offering people an opportunity to get started in this industry where they would otherwise not have a chance. So it's really a great position to be in. The best advice I could give is to uh... You know, it's just the dedication to it. If, it. if it's an opportunity you want to take advantage of, it's definitely here for you. It doesn't matter how old you are, how young you are, uh, you know, male, female, you know, anything about you. It's just it's going to be your work ethic that dictates where you go in this company. Um, there's no fixed, you know, at the first company I worked at in my life, you know, the, or my after college, after one year, you were uh, you could up, up for a raise and it was a certain percentage. There was no merit raises, and that's just not the case here. Your work ethic directly dictates how much uh, you earn and how much you get from this company. The company, it's sky's the limit. You know, there's no cap. You can go as far as you want to go. It's what you put into it. Um, and it's, it's just an opportunity that, that may not come along again. So grab it, take it, and enjoy it. What I would advise scouts to do to be successful in this company is to uh, work hard. Uh, it's a fun job, but it's not an easy job. Uh, it does require a, a lot of dedication. And uh, enjoy what you do. Uh, make sure you achieve your goals uh, and set some goals that uh, you want to achieve that will make you happy in your life. It's very easy to get frustrated uh, in a company like this because of things happening so fast, because you might run into setbacks. You have to keep looking to where this company is going, where your potential lies in this company. There's so many avenues. The advice that I would give to a scout is to just have fun out there. Uh, this is a great business to be in. Um, I mean, I don't know of anyone who would not want to be uh, a model scout or be in the, be in the modeling industry itself. Um, you go out, you scout models all over, all over the, uh, you know, whether it be in a nightclub or, uh, or on the beach or in a park. It's just a great business to be in. Just go out and don't give up. If you get five people that walk away from you or that are not you know, receptive to what you're trying to do, it's just chalk it up and go on to the next five and the next five and never give up. You have to be focused on every person that you talk to as a new person and, and a person that's, that has the potential to move into something else because the person you just scouted that may have turned you down, they have nothing to do with the new scout that you're, the new person that you're talking to because they're totally different people. Now you've heard from the people behind the scenes. But options only works if it works for the models and the agencies that we serve. Listen closely to what they have to say. A friend recommended someone to me to place in one of our stories, and he happened, uh, when I asked him for a, a photograph of himself, you know, I was speaking to him on the phone, and he said, oh, log on to this website, and there are photos of me online. And I found this website, and it was just astounding, all the other uh, uh, talent that I found there. My agency is so busy, it's very hard for us to scout. And we really don't find that many people through open call. 
So it's very nice that I can come one place and get this much talent and do this many interviews, see this many people at once. It's kind of nice. Well, the models that I've seen are exceptional. Um, it looks like there's a lot of really great new faces um, to be discovered. We've actually already signed at New York Models two of the guys off of the website. So they're already at our office. One actually has already done some editorials and done really well. So I completely am a big supporter and fan. Not to mention the fact that we're going to be working together on our model search that we have Options Talent is a uh, presenting sponsor for it. So we're very excited about the relationship. This is so much more comprehensive what Options has done in terms of, of national and, and a world scale and, and with the internet. So the possibilities in terms of recruitment for our company in conjunction with Options seems to be limitless for the future. Yes, we do use the uh, Options uh, website and the database and the search engine and, and that's very helpful. Um, it's a great way to see the talent raw on the web and it comes right at you um, with the things that you're looking for. Um, we can sort of control you know, height requirements uh, for our company, so it's nice. And it's fantastic, and, and they like it, and we like it, and it's just, it's opened so many doors. I can honestly say that, the, that if an agency utilizes the web properly, um, they will definitely increase their billing and their talent will work more, and we've definitely seen that. Yeah, this is really just the, the gate, the doorway is opening now for every individual, and um, you know, it, it's, you never know. I mean, anything can happen. You can have somebody with a phenomenal look, and um, they just other things don't fall into place. And you can have somebody that maybe their look isn't as good, but they sell themselves so well in person that you know they can climb to levels that everyone would have assumed that the other individual you know would have naturally done. I think that you know the whole company options and the whole group is has a, a great great future. This is innovative. It's. Um, it's been well worth our time and energy put into it. Um, on behalf of our company, I know that we'll be looking forward to um, a long future with options um, through the events, um, through the interaction on the website, and I can, I, I'm sure we're going to find countless talent over the years. I, I definitely know that options is in it for the long haul. If this isn't going to be something that just stops today or, or tomorrow, so it's a long future and it's going to be a long relationship. The concept of options is it's, it's very, very good. The, the number of models that are on the, the website is obviously it's huge, um, but every agency is going to be looking for a different look um, to be able to search that website and definitively look for a particular type of talent is excellent and to get so many different hits for what we're looking for, again. I can't get that from anywhere else, basically. Um, I actually work in the office and book models on jobs Monday through Friday, so I don't have time to go out to the malls and to football games and concerts and look for the newest face, you know, um, because I'm working all week too. So it's easy for me to either do the little virtual search on the website and just have them emailed to me, and if I like them, I'll look at them, and if I don't like them, then I, you know, can pass them over and go to the next one. So it's efficient and fast, you know, and it's helpful that way. Options approach to the internet is great. It takes a lot of stress off me as far as walking, getting out there all the time, comp cards, money, it's convenient. I received uh, about 15 callbacks. Um, it was an MTV boss, LA model, some, some big ones. I, I can't wait to go talk. Actually, I'm uh, very into the computer thing and it's really good concept to putting people uh, on the internet because the whole world actually can see, not just like one, two people in one city or one agency. And uh, uh, I think the big companies like, let's say example, uh, Dell company, this is how they become even popular because, you know, they start selling uh, products and here we're selling the models. All over, almost all over the world because if there's an agency in Tokyo or different countries, you know, they always can get the information in a second just going to the website. I thought it sounded pretty cool, but you never really know with people just approaching you if it's for real or not. But, you know, I went that night and scoped it out and I thought it sounded really cool. And I'm like, there's nothing I could lose. So, you know, I joined. I'm so glad I did. But I live in a really small town in the middle of California, so it's really hard to get down to LA or to San Francisco or anywhere around there. So I can just, you know, be at home and work on my pictures and all that good stuff and you know people come to me. So it's really great for that reason.